I don't think I have many opportunities to get away from here. He usually patrols the front. I think he's around the side of the house. I gotta go for it. I gotta go for it. Why do you have to slowly turn around? <gasps> oh. Wait, I have no way out. Oh, uh, oh, uh, no. I'm not trespassing. I'm not trespassing. You're trespassing. Go away. Go away. Stupid pedestrian. I forgot that last time when I stole the car, I opened the gate and drove away. <gasps> I don't have a way out. I jumped over the fence. Oh, no. What's up guys and welcome back to Thief Simulator. So last episode we stole this souped up pickup truck, got it back here in between episodes, I've torn it down, sold off all the parts, we now have almost $32,000. And I know what you're thinking, is Sneezy Anus finally going to invest in his future? I mean, is he finally going to spend this money on stocks and bonds, maybe a nice down payment on a house, an actual bed? Nope, he's going to blow $28,000 on a car key signal cloner. <laughs> I'm sure Vinny will be proud. Vinny, you enable me, you know that? We want you to send a message to Mr. Torres. Get me his car. He always got the key on him, so you need to steal it, Signal. I'm not sure how that's gonna work. People in this neighborhood are very testy when you get near them. <laughs> Even if they're sound asleep, so that's gonna be interesting. I, I was gonna say, I don't think this thing sends messages, Vinny. That's what my phone is for. For $28,000, it should. For $28,000, it should puree fruit and make julian fries, but I doubt it. I'm just gonna say it right now, this is gonna suck. This place is like Fort Knox. They have an eight-foot fence around the whole place. They have cameras at every gate. They have giant marbles atop columns. Like, only rich people could afford this crap. Vinny, how close is close? Because I feel like I'm pretty close. I, I could spit into the wind and hit him from here. <gasps> For $28,000. Oh, this is pissing me off. Do you think he ever leaves the house? I doubt it. I, I sincerely doubt it. I probably need to find a way in. I honestly cannot believe this. I thought, okay, maybe I'll hardcore parkour my way over the wall by jumping on this rock, but they have a camera set up for that. They're prepared for people to jump over the fence on nearby rocks. I, I just, it's just dumbfounding. Can I go anyway? Oh huh? my God, that worked. I'm in. Oh, I can't blow this. How close do I need to be? I also need to be very careful of other cameras. They're all over the place, and of course they have their windows closed at night. Why wouldn't they? Oh! It worked! Did it work? I think it worked. It worked! Steal Vulcan Spectre from the garage. Oh, thank God. <laughs> okay, so if anything, I want to avoid the security guard. I want to avoid Mr. Torres. I just need to find my way into the house somehow. Where's the security guard? I don't see him on my x-ray vision. This is like my only chance. I can't believe this. <laughs> Does he actually go home? I thought he was a 24 seven guy. Oh yes, yes, yes. I leveled up a skill that lets me climb gutters. Oh yeah, that's the stuff. Nice open door. Let that night breeze in. <laughs> that's my nickname, the night breeze. Ooh, that looks expensive. Nope, that's a book. I'm an idiot. Okay, all I need to do is, oh no, I don't need to just get into the garage, right? I need to open the front gate as well. Ooh, crap. Is he asleep? That's something expensive. He's over here somewhere, right? You asleep, Mr. Torres? Because if you're asleep and there's nobody else here, I'm sitting pretty. I can't tell whether he's asleep or not, but I do know that I need all of the computers and electronics that I can get my little gloved hands on, so I'll take it all. Thank you very much. <laughs> Gotta make this worth my time. And then there's also an antique over here. Antique book, $4,000! Oh, baby, that's the stuff. Okay, can we find this stupid gate entrance? Is there something here? Uh, switch to open the gate. It's in the first floor hall next to the piano. Of course he has a piano. Why wouldn't he have a piano? This really feels like the kind of spot that would have a camera, 
but I'm not seeing anything. I wanted to make sure to say that out loud because if I step in a camera, I want you guys to know that I tried. <gasps> oh, come on. Where is it? Switch to open the gate. Oh, it's over here next to the piano. Perfect, this is why you pay for the highlighters, okay? It's not for the hints, it's for the highlighters. So I should be able to do that. And that, oh yeah, that kind of concerns the guard. Um, he's back. Where was the garage again? Crap, 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 I should be sneaking right now. Yes, I should, yes, I should. I'm gonna take that though, that looks expensive. Uh, inventory full. Uh, I don't care, I don't care. Where the hell is the garage? I just got so freaking lucky, oh my god. <gasps> oh, how did I not trip that? I don't even know how to go back. Ugh. Okay, uh, okay, I need, I need the garage, I need the garage, where would it be? It's clearly on the main floor, he doesn't have a second story garage. <gasps> I need to get past that camera, and to get past the camera, I need to turn them off. Right? Security panel? Security panel. Let's do this one first. Um, ooh. This one's a bit of a mess. You... You... And... Uh... You? Oh! Good! Good, good! Did that, uh, concern the guard? No? And then how about this? We'll hack you as well. Just a hacking spree. <laughs> Two for one on hacking, today only. There we go, that's the stuff. Okay, so all security should be offline, right? Garage has to be over here somewhere, I would imagine. I think he's over here somewhere. I don't want to get closer to him. That's footsteps. I don't want, oh, that's security guard footsteps. <laughs> I just saw a really expensive, I need to take this, right? What am I doing? I need to like drop a laptop or something. Stop being an idiot. Here, drop that. Take the $4,000 antique. Figure out where the hell the garage is. I, th there's nothing else. I'm not stupid, right? It, it was on this side of the house. But there's nothing here. This has to be it. This has to be it. This is it. I did it. Okay. Um, Probably hack the car first. Then open the door. Right? I wouldn't need to hotwire it twice, would I? I swear to God, if I get out of this car and turn it off, I'm gonna lose my mind. Is that a thing? Oh, I don't know. I'm gonna have to risk it. <laughs> I'm gonna have to risk it. Okay, we're gonna open this real slow. It doesn't look like it has an alarm. I'm gonna get in, and we're going to hot... Oh. Oh. It doesn't need to be hotwired, right? I'm an idiot, I, I stole the key thing. I'm not paying attention, I'm panicking. <laughs> I'm gonna open this and just go, go, go. Peel out of this thing. You better believe we are going on an absolute joyride with this. Uh, uh, go, go, oh my God, it's so fast, it doesn't turn. <laughs> Don't shoot me, security guard, for the love of God. <laughs> go, 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 go. <laughs> oh, I think we're good. Right, we were detected, but they didn't call the police. Oh, we're super good. I can just drive this thing around for as long as I want. Who's the rich man now? I know I probably shouldn't do this, but I have to find out what happens if I ram this thing into a pole at full speed. Nothing? Wow. You get what you pay for. I just realized that if I had hit a pedestrian when I was escaping there, I would have lost my mind. I don't know what I was thinking going for a joyride in a car that I cannot control. A rank is acceptable, okay? I did technically get spotted, but I got away with some pretty sweet stuff. Vinny, can I keep it? Why do I keep the crappy pickup trucks and you get the sports cars? It doesn't make sense. The last house has the best electronic locks around. But make sure you're ready, because this job matters. What do you mean the last house? Is this the end? It might be, honestly, because I'm pretty sure I have all other skills. Electronics level three requires level 27. So I'm not quite there yet, unfortunately, but I do have quite a bit of stuff to sell to Igor. And there are a few houses that we overlooked. I'm gonna think of it, in the old neighborhood, 
there were some rich houses among the poor people that we never robbed. I don't know why. My antique appraisal is way off. $4,000? No, no. $8,000 and $8,000. $16,000. We might get those stocks and bonds yet. I'm not losing my mind, right? We definitely have not robbed this house before. By the looks of it, we even have a bunch of thug missions to do. Break or steal their lamp. Break their sink. Might have some good stuff to... To steal what car parked in a strange place? Oh, really? No, don't call the police just because I'm parked on a walking path. God, the people in this game. I'm so tempted to back up over you, lady. There, continue your walk. Leave me the hell alone. Well, we've got pretty good eyes on the wife. She likes to just stand there, stare off into space, walk a couple feet, sit down, stare into more space. Bit of a strange broad. Problem is, her husband is literally patrolling. He's roaming around the house just looking for thieves, I guess. <laughs> Overcomplicates things for sure. Heidi ho there, neighborino. Maybe I could uh, borrow you for all your valuables? No? Well then, see if I care. You just do some gardening. I'll be back tonight. Oh damn, there's a third person here. Do they actually have a kid? Is this the first time we've ever seen a kid in this game? Or is this some kind of weird Mormon house? You never know. Regardless, I set up a camera, so I should be able to retrieve it. There's only one person home between 11 and 5 a.m. Okay. Well, uh, I guess I can come back again? I might be able to sneak around three people. We'll, we'll give it a, a, a try. This is a bad idea. <laughs> yeah, this, this is a straight up bad idea. I'm not even able to get through the front door without being seen. I really don't like pedestrians in this game. They just bother me because there are annoyances in the way and they don't make any sense. Guys, it's almost midnight. There's five people in my vision out for a walk. You won't even see that in the middle of the day most places. I need to trespass. There's only one person home right now. I just sneak on in. I don't think they would have cameras, right? There's no way. So if you're gonna hang out on the first floor, I don't really wanna hack that door. I think I'm just gonna climb up here. Is that okay? All I really need to do is steal things, right? This is a free-for-all. I'm not doing this for Vinny. One of the first times I'm actually doing something for myself. Feels good. Making a name for myself here in the thieving world, busting lamps. <laughs> and I... Oh, we're just gonna, yeah, let's glass it. That's probably a good idea. I was gonna say I could try opening it anyway, but I don't know. There we go. So is it steel or, no, it's, it's break. Okay, well, I guess I have no choice but to break. She heard that. Yeah, th that would make sense that she would ignore that. You guys gotta have something worth a shit in here. Come on, I guess I can take some wine. That's usually, what, 25 bucks for a pound? And eh, not great. <laughs> it is the poor end of town, okay? They might have a nice house, but that just means they probably can't afford other nice things. Oh man, just take whatever I can and get out with Ness rank so I can level up. That's the main thing that I need to do. Butt plug trophy, $9. Not all that interested. What about you? You worth anything? $8. Why own an $8 vase and keep it in a drawer? $50 cash, I'll take that. Well, this kid had a $220 X-Cube controller before he passed away, I guess. He didn't have the console, which is a real bummer. That's where all the money would have been. I think I want to leave. Uh, ooh, nope. Nope. Don't want to leave. I, say, I don't want to go downstairs where she is, but uh, definitely do some mm, safe cracking. It's hard to commentate and not screw up at the same time because you're, because you're supposed to be listening. <laughs> Can I please get... Uh, oh, okay. 50 100 150 dollars and a $1,500 bracelet. Decent. You won't miss that, will you, lady? I think we're good. I'll fill up my backpack with whatever junk I can find, but I really don't want to get caught because, like I said, I'm here for the experience. I don't care about the money. I'm already rich. He says as he pushes his luck far too long. Okay, that's enough. <laughs> Time to leave. Do you think I can just run and jump? Yeah, there we go. We're good. That has to be S rank. I was never seen. I was never heard. I'm like a fart in the wind. 
Come on, look at all that stuff. A? What do you mean A? I filled up my backpack with everything. I did the safe. I was never seen. I don't understand. Why would you give me four out of five stealth bonus? This game is a ripoff. Well, luckily for the dipshit judge who's handing out scores, I leveled up anyway. So now I can learn electronics level three. Which means I need to buy hacking laptop. Oh god, how much does a hacking laptop cost? That can't be cheap. $52,000? Oh, you can just go down on me, Vinny. What do you mean? $52,000! We're just gonna have to do a little freelancing in the rich end of town. Because if I keep leaving the poor neighborhood with like a couple hundred bucks, it's gonna take me 50 years to earn this laptop. We just robbed this place, but we didn't get to explore all of it. And we know that that security guard likes to take some time off. Maybe I can jump this again and get... I feel like I got pretty lucky that time, but maybe I can get lucky again? Okay. What are the odds he bought another car? Wait, he actually leaves? Does that mean there's nobody home? I have a free pass. I'm pretty sure Security Joe was still off. Oh, this is too easy. He says before inevitably screwing this up. I'm gonna stomp around and grab everything I can, but I don't know how long he's gone for. My backpack's almost full. Full of electronics and other expensive things. What are those, microphones? I thought they were nunchucks for a second. Would definitely steal some nunchucks. That looks expensive. Fabergé egg! How did I miss this the last time next to the $3 globe? Oh, oh, oh crap. Maybe we should be a little quiet now. A little bit quieter. Looks like someone's home. There's no way the security guard would come in here though, right? And I'm pretty sure dude is still away. Maybe... I don't know if I should risk this, but I'm gonna try, ooh, $1,400 clock. I'm gonna try to fit all the expensive things in my backpack before I leave. How much are you worth? $6. $6 Apple vase or $1,400 clock. Yeah, they're gonna have to be sacrifices. I don't think I have many opportunities to get away from here. He usually patrols the front. I think he's around the side of the house. I gotta go for it. I gotta go for it. Why do you have to slowly turn around? <sighs> oh. Wait, I have no way out. Oh, uh, oh, uh, no, I'm not trespassing. I'm not trespassing. You're trespassing. Go away. Go away. Stupid pedestrian. I forgot that last time when I stole the car, I opened the gate and drove away. <gasps> I don't have a way out. I jumped over the fence. Oh, no. First things first, we need to disable security. We absolutely have to get all of this out of the way. It's good. I don't think I need to worry about the windows. That might also be for the gate. We probably want to do this as well. Ooh. Is he home? Is that him? It shouldn't be, right? Because I already completed this mission. I got away with the car. Oh, I don't know what's going on. Why do I still have that marker? Here we go. Okay, security is down. Cameras are down. I'm gonna slip over here and, uh, ooh, that looks expensive. 78, Freeze. no, no, oh, that thing is worth $7,800. That stupid little thing right there. Mm, we're going back, we're going back. My only problem was that I didn't have an escape plan and that's gonna change this time. I'm gonna pick the front gate and then as soon as we get everything, I'm just gonna walk through the camera, right? It's unlocked now. Remember, the left gate on the way out is the one that we're gonna escape through. <laughs> That's fine. I don't care if they see me. As long as I get away, I'm good. I'm not looking for any ranking here. I'm looking for a crap load of money, which they have. Come on now. Parkour, parkour. Eh, no. We're good. We're good. Flawless. He shouldn't be here, right? Security guard. You here? He randomly shows up. I really don't appreciate that. I don't see him. Great. Okay, we're going upstairs immediately. We have a plan. All we have to do is execute it properly this time, and we know where all of the big expensive things are. We have the $1,000 Fabergé egg. 
We have the $1,400 clock. We have the $1,600 clock. And we also have a lot of electronics. I'm feeling pretty good. If we can get that statue downstairs and turn off all of the security without getting shot, then I think we'll be home free. I would love to look around down here a little bit more, but there's too many windows, too many prying eyes. Please don't see me. Please just let me get over there. What is this? Oh, that looks expensive. $115 for a violin? What kind of cheap ass violin is that? Antique statue. That usually angers him. That usually angers him. Okay, we're gonna go over here. $9 glass. You can't tell what's gonna be $9 and what's gonna be $9,000. Why are these all the same color? Oh my god. Um, uh, no. Uh, yes. Uh, yes, yes. There we go. Okay. And again, I don't know what this one does, but I, I can't leave it. Can't risk it, especially when it's just one move. Sure, thank you. Appreciate that. <laughs> now, we could go further, but I really don't want to. I'm, I'm feeling pretty good. You know what? I'm going to take this anyway. $9 in my pocket. $22 in my pocket. Not yours. That's mine as well. I don't think I should take the gate, though. I think I want to surveil the area from above. That seems like a much smarter idea. I gotta move a little bit faster. I don't like sneaking. I don't like moving slowly. Guess who's home? I'm really happy that I didn't decide to poke around in his room. I don't see the security guard, though. The gate's open. So technically, I don't need to blow past the cameras, which are off. I already covered all my bases. I don't know what I was thinking. Can I please just get out of here? Can you stop doing your silly little pirouettes? Just, just run. Just run. Oh my god, I did it. I cannot believe we managed to pull that off. That is such an S rank. And that antique statue was appraised by me at $7,800. But I'm an idiot. That could very well be worth $15,000. It's always double what I think it is. Why am I so dumb? Oh, that is going to make this laptop so much easier to get. Igor, I really need $12,000, and I don't think you're gonna get me here. Ooh. Fabergé egg replica. He doesn't want. I didn't see that for sale online, did I? That might be $2,000. Okay, well, really? You want the $9 glass plate, the $8 picture of a rose, but you don't want the $1,000 Fabergé egg? <laughs> what is wrong with you, Igor? You're such an idiot. Okay, just take all of that, and I need to break that apart. $45,000. we are still $7,000 short. Damn. You know what? I think that's going to be it for this episode of Thief Simulator, guys. And I feel really accomplished. I gotta say, you know, we robbed three or four houses. Technically, one house twice. We got a lot of electronics and antiques, a supercar. And now we might be moving on to the last episode. You know, it's like I said, I think there are a few houses around that we haven't hit because of the story, but there's really only one more mission left as far as I can tell. I'm really looking forward to seeing exactly what Vinny has in store to finish things off. But thanks so much for watching this video. I hope you enjoyed, and I'll see you next time.